And welcome back to some more Metroid Prime Remastered. In the last video, we did basically a repeat of the previous episode. The one with uh, the last episode, we did a repeat of the one before that. Which is to say, we continued the artifact hunt. And then got stuck for so long on one of them that I unfortunately had to look it up. Kinda sucks. I mean, I've got my uh, uh, gripes with... Um, the hunt itself and those two ones in particular, which I've outlined in the respective episodes. Um, yeah. Basically, I don't think this game does enough to lead you to get them. Like the only the basically the only hint the game gives you is it it gives you an idea of what the room will be because a a word is highlighted, right? And in the the name of the room it's it's what it's like the word is in the name but that becomes a problem when there are multiple rooms with that name and um so that's for the episode before the last one and then the last episode was i just don't think the game uh did the game did not provide anything to lead you to the right solution, if that makes sense. So there's a hidden door, okay. The hint said uh, an unseen door or something. Sure. Maybe for some people that was enough of a hint to indicate, hey, um, you need to use a different visor. And granted, I did notice that with a thermal visor, you could see doors through walls. But, I don't think the game had, you know, the game made, like, emphasized that in any way. Alright, so, we've got all the artifacts, and now we go back to the Talon Overworld. Because there are also, there's also one more room I wanted to check out before, um, actually going to presumably the final boss. Oh wait, there's a meta Ridley. Yeah, I'm not... If it wasn't already obvious, I'm not completely new to this game, I guess. Alright, uh, let's see, which way to... Oh, not phase in mind. Unless I want to go scouring for... The rest of the Mistal expansions, and the last energy tank, which... I'm not, um... There are probably some more Plasma Bomb expansions around as well. I've gotten two or three of them, and I think you start with three, so... I mean, if each of them gives one, which I think that's what it's saying. Six, that's kind of a weird number. And if not, nine, that's also... I, I can math. I don't... Yeah, it would, I don't know. The math... Wait, this is literally the room I wanted to be in. Um, yeah, I don't... I don't know. I'd assume you either have five or ten, but we're past five. So let's see what's up here. You know, I think in Prime 2, you were also able to shoot while grappling. Wait, were you? No, I was thinking of something else. Where was it? Um. Excuse me. Huh. Oh, you can see the particles on it too. That's pretty cool. Yeah, maybe I am just bad and not being able to uh, realize to, that I should have used the X-ray visor, the thermal visor to see the door. I don't know. It does give us like this, right? To, ooh, can I? Yeah. It does give us that. Um, it teaches us. We use it to see invisible pl platforms at the very least. But I don't know. Another missile expansion. Alright. Off to a good start. Like I said, I'm not going to look for every single one of them. Alright. Meta Ridley.
That's all the artifacts. Meta Ridley, I know you're out there. Last time I saw you, you were flying over Fendrana. Oh yeah, space pirates definitely aren't, isn't aren't space pirates definitely are not gonna notice that. Ah, there it is. There's the theme. First time I heard this theme was in Smash Bros. Brawl. Um, the Subspace Bomb Factory 2 escape sequence. Hello. Uh oh. Wait. Uh oh. <laughs> how, how, how am I gonna open the door now? Is Ridley gonna. Alright. Is this a is this a boss rush? Okay. Ow. Get over here. Let me scan you. Okay. Yep. Okay, save for the chest, which has thinner plating. Multi missile system, kinetic breath what kinetic breath? What? Mason bomb launcher, ultra thermal flame strike projector. Alright. Okay, 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 chill. I know I killed Mother Brain, but chill. Ow. Why is it on Ice Beam? Can I use the Wave Buster on you? Wait. What? What did I take damage from? Oh, that. Where are you? Come on. Bro, I'm literally just running into them. There go a bunch of my missiles. And I have missiles again. Why is it keep going to Ice Beam? I'm pressing Wave Beam. I wonder if it's like the Annihilator Beam where it'll still home when I'm not locked on, as long as it's close. Wonder how much damage the ice spreader will do. Let's try it. I don't know about the ice beam's damage in general, but come on, stop being untargetable. Oh, my cover. Eh, who needs cover? If you can't aim, who needs cover? Where are you? There you are. 
I don't want to use the ice beam from super far away. I want to. I want her to land. Land. Come on. Land. Oh, please. Because missing the ice spreader would be kind of a fat oof and 10 missiles. Oops, I did not see those ones. You know what? Screw it. Ice spreader, go! I don't actually know how much damage that did. I looked away from the health bar. Get another one. Okay. Okay. It's almost dead. Are you just staying on the ground now? Or are you breaking the ground here? Oh, your wings are gone. <laughs> okay. Uh, I have my hands not on my controller because I was adjusting my headphones. Do I get missiles back or anything? Do I get it? Is there another scan? No. Okay. Oh, I can... You have metal! Why can I barely see you? An x-ray visor! Oh. Alright, we're playing Pokemon with that tail whip. Okay, whoops. Why is it locking onto its head? I thought it said the chest was the weak point. Okay, stop trying to stomp on me, please. I didn't jump fast enough. Okay. Come on. Can you take damage? Charge. Yep. Just gonna charge. Oops. Charge. Charge. Let me switch. Can 
Can I power bomb you? <laughs> All right. Whoops. Come on, I'm not trying to sidestep here. I did not. I wanted to sidestep there. What the frick? Okay. Come on. What the frick? Oh my goodness. Did I not jump soon enough? How much health do you have? Timing on that seems kind of tight. I thought I was getting it. Clearly not. Wow. Come on! Are you serious? My goodness, there is no way. Are you serious? Bro. Oh my Freaking goodness. I can't hit you. This is getting frustrating. Like, there, there's absolutely no way, right? I'm already on 300 health left. Was it 400? 400. Here we go. Holy crap, that was so annoying. But if this is a boss rush, though, I'm kind of in trouble. Oh, okay, Chozo Bar... <laughs> Chozo statues are just gonna beam Ridley off. Oh, cool, hello. Please tell me I can go back and at least restore my health and ammo and whatever. But yeah, trying to figure out the when it, it can actually hit its head to make it expose the, its chest was kind of annoying. Okay, weeds, stop. I don't like how those things home.
You know what? <laughs> that was 26 minutes. I just spent right there. I know I'm not cutting out a lot of this because it's a boss fight. I spent a lot of that time on a boss fight. So, for me, it's a shorter... Recorded a shorter episode. Yeah, I, I'm going to leave off for this one, especially if the, the next bit is a boss rush. Um, I think it is, sort of. Two phases. Um, I don't want it to go way too long. So, yeah, that'll be it for this episode. I got a bunch of expansions, at least, and I beat Meta Ridley. I'm expecting the next episode to be the last one. Yeah, so thanks. Uh, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video of me <laughs> getting frustrated with Meta Ridley or my other content, please consider liking, sharing, and subscribing. Leave some feedback down in the comments below. Um, as usual, full unedited video will be linked unlisted in the description. Um, it's probably not going to be a whole lot different, actually. <laughs> but yeah, thanks again. I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.